Hi folks, welcome back. Dad Bod's Hot Rods Garage. Today we're working on the 61 Mercury Meteor and we're going to be replacing the carburetor and the fuel pump. You can see that down there or not, but <clears throat> we've got a nice brand new carburetor from Amazon. Um, <laughs> if it doesn't work, I'm only out 45 bucks. If it does work, it fixes my problem, great. But the plan today is to change out the carburetor, change out the fuel pump, and take this beauty for a ride around the block. And that should pretty much finish off the car, other than some minor things. Um, I think it's gonna be fun. Out with the old, on with the new. There we go. Bring you guys in a little closer while I try to finagle this thing on here. I got fittings I needed for the fuel inlet, which kind of unfortunately it didn't come with the with this fitting for the fuel inlet. And that fuel inlet doesn't have the provision for a filter like the factory one had, which is nice to have a little stainless steel screen filter that goes in there to catch what this doesn't catch and the rear filter doesn't catch. Just one less means of protection in there between the tank and the carburetor. So anyways. Right here is the fuel pump. I just got a couple of bolts and I'm hoping I'll be able to pull her out of there. Out with the old. Okay, well, forgot to set the camera up, but new fuel pump is in. New carburetor is on. We're gonna prime the system now for fuel and see if we can get it to start. <clears throat> test, test, let's see if she runs. Look at that. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Might be able to drive it around the block today. <laughs> All right, I gotta button up a couple more things. I need to put some more trans fluid in, some more engine oil in. I wanna get it up in the air and take out that electric fuel pump since my mechanical pump's working well now. We got a good amount of fuel. Everything seems to be working. I, I'm happy. I'm happy with that. Mm -hmm. 